Rotary in New York. I am in New York for Coterie, and it's another large show that we're selling our spring lines. And basically, this is an East Coast show. So our East Coast showroom handles the show, and it's all of their East Coast accounts, and also international. By the time that I'm done with Coterie, I'm hoping to get new accounts. That's always the hope with this kind of show. Like, you know, it's great if accounts that always already write the line, but it would be fabulous to get new people interested in the brand. Um, we had some clients come from Japan and they love it. They like a lot of the new vintage group in the floral group. So. We've had people from Europe um, come by and there's a really like big international interest in the brand, so that's really exciting. They're kind of moving away from the all over print. They still like the all over print, but they like all of our new stuff. I made a decision when designing the line to kind of cut down on the amount of styles I did in the all over print just because I wanted to focus on more fashion driven pieces. Like we have a lot of woven dresses and even jersey pieces that don't have print and are more like vintage inspired. And it's really went over really, really well. Like everyone loved it. We've gotten a great response. Well, we cut back some stuff that from the lace group that wasn't selling really well? The lace group? <laughs> the lace group didn't go as well as I had hoped. I personally love the lace group, but apparently I was the only one. So. I think our embroidered pieces have been doing really well, like our American Indian embroidery. We always do well with our embroidered embellishments. Um, our new vintage inspired group that has a screen and then embroidery also has been doing really well and our floral group. Lisa Klein came by earlier and they loved everything. She and her buyers circled a lot of stuff. They're going to place the order when we get back to LA. One of our sales reps made a comment that usually stores come in and just buy one group. But from this collection, they've been buying a couple styles from each category, like the lace group, the vintage group, the embroidered group. So that means that every group is equally as strong. So. We actually do say no to people. Um, if it's an account that's within like a three mile radius of an account that we already sell, we have to say no. There's nothing you can do, it's just, that's like the kind of unwritten rule. Or if our sales reps or myself are familiar with the store and we don't feel like it's a perfect fit for the line, then we have to say no. I have some good ideas for summer. As soon as we get off the plan, I'm going to start designing summer so I can be ahead of the game.